Okay guys, welcome back. Today we're gonna to show you how to test your pool water with a DPD test kit. Okay, so people ask all the time, what's the best way to check for chlorine on their swimming pool? And this is the absolute best. We're gonna use DPD powder, and let me show you how easy it is. You take this powder and get one scoop and put it in the large test tube and that's filled to the number 10. If it turns red, you've got chlorine. Now here's the cool part. We're gonna find out how much. Each drop that Jake is about to put in is worth one half of one point. So there's one drop, so that's a half. And what we're looking for is this to turn clear. There's two drops, so we're at one. Three drops, one and a half. We're getting close. Four drops. And now see the sample is turned clear. So we know that the chlorine on this pool, four drops, each drop is a half a point, so that is two. Okay, so for the second test, we're gonna show you how accurate the DPD powder is. This is on the 0.2 scale, so you can see Jake has already got it filled to the 25 mark, which is right in the middle. He's gonna put in the same amount of DPD powder. Now that the, the test kit says two scoops, but we just do one giant heaping scoop, and that's usually about the same. Okay, so that turned the sample red, so we know there's chlorine. Now he's gonna start adding the liquid and each drop will indicate 0.2. So there's 0 0.2, 0 0.4, 0 0.6. Now we know this sample is about one and a half. So, so there's 0 0.8, that's 1.0, 1.2, he's gonna shake it again, 1.4. Okay, we're almost there, still a little bit of pink to it. And one more drop, 1.6. Hold it up where we can see it. So you can see we've gone from red to clear, and that took eight drops. Each drop is worth 0.2, so we know the chlorine is 1.6. All right, so what we also love about the DE DPD powder is that if you if your chlorine is zero, you're gonna see it instantly. So he's got the water test kit, and he's gonna put in the powder, one scoop of the DPD powder, and it should turn red. Drop that in, swirl it. Now see this sample, how it did not turn red. Hold it up, Jake, where we can see it. Yeah, see that sample is still clear. That tells us that the chlorine is zero. So we know we gotta add some chlorine, but DPD will test it very accurately um, all the way down to 0 0.2. We're using the lower scale, hold it this way to the side. So on this test tube right here, you can see there's a line here for the 10. There's a line here for the 25. So when we test on this level, each drop is a half. When we test on this level, each drop is 0.2. So if we have a, a sample that we think is gonna have low chlorine, we'll fill it to this one, and then we can go 0 0.2, 0 0.4, 0 0.6, and get a very accurate reading. So, But you can see how much more accurate that is than the old yellow strips or test kit where the water turned bright orange if you had, or bright yellow if you had chlorine. And it was really hard to differentiate how much it was, or even using the test strips where you don't get a good sample. But if you really want quality, the DPD powder on the Taylor test kit is the way to go. We'll put a link in the description. Thanks for watching and have a great summer.